Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you this backup system. So I've got a main switch here that will basically isolate the full house from the grid and basically simulate us going to a power cut situation. So if you keep your eyes on the lights, you'll see them go off and then hopefully within about five to ten seconds they should come back on. It does feel about a minute <laughs> when you are waiting for them to come back on, but uh, yeah, let's see what happens. So I'm going to drop this main switch in three, two, one. There we go. And like I say, it does feel about a minute. Oh, that was really quick, actually. There we go. So we're now running on the battery system. Um, I'm so relieved that, that was <laughs> that was only that long because I've done it in the past and it has felt like a long time. But this full property has now come back on and is effectively running on the backup system. So you can see how quick that changeover was. Now the customer, I maybe should have pre-warned him, but the customer <laughs> will be getting a notification to so say your house is now going to backup mode and it will give them basically a countdown of, of how long they've got on with their current usage, how long they've got running on the battery in the solar. This battery is fully charged, the sun's out, so it's probably like nine, 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 nine hours <laughs> because they're, they're in a perfect position. There's very little usage in here. But if you were to come in, put the kettle on, which you would be able to do because you've got five kilowatts to play with, six kilowatts during the day. If you've got solar, it'll allow you to add one kilowatt to that because of the sun. So it's enough to run like a, a, a ring on your electric hob, uh, your cooker, if it's not a massive range master thing, uh, lots of things. So it gives you a really good amount of headroom there to, to run with. So yeah, that's the situation. And if I, so if I turn this back onto the grid, so effectively like the power being reinstated, you'll notice that, well, let's see, let's see what we do notice. So we're gonna come back on, there we go. So it's a really small little flicker and we're now back onto the grid supply and the customer's probably now got a notification to say you are now back on the grid supply, which I'm gonna text him now and let him know why he's got those notifications. <laughs> we can see how quickly that changeover happens. It even surprised me this time, which is good. But uh, in the long term, it just adds an extra functionality to the system so you're getting more for your money, basically. So yeah, that is the backup system.